Hello, this is Brad Hall of Intuit Canada's business development team. Today I'm going to show you a very useful feature of the QuickBooks Online Accountant Edition. First, a quick primer on terminology. QBO stands for QuickBooks Online, the cloud-based version of QuickBooks. QBOA stands for QuickBooks Online Accountant Edition. QBOA is the portal where you, as an accounting or bookkeeping firm, see and access all of your clients who have invited you to be their accountant or bookkeeper in QBO. So it's very common for firms to have multiple staff who work on a specific client's file. When your QBO client invites your firm to be their accountant or bookkeeper, they frequently invite a specific staff member to access their file. Now QBO allows for two accountants or bookkeepers to be invited, so they could invite a second person. But what if you have more than two people who work on the file? Or what if your client wants to invite an accountant and they also have a separate bookkeeping firm? Many users believe that they have to share their QBOA login credentials in order to let more people in their office get to the file. Fortunately, this is not the case. So today, I'm going to teach you how to work with a single QBOA account and give all members of your firm access to your QBO clients. As an accounting or bookkeeping firm, Ideally, you need to have only one QBOA account. I strongly recommend that you create a single firm-wide QBOA account using a generic email address, such as info at accountingfirm.ca or even QBOA at. This approach keeps your QBO accounts from being tied to any one person at your office which is a good thing in case that person wins the lottery and immediately retires to the Cayman Islands. Then you assign one or two people in your office to manage any QuickBooks online messages or invitations that come in to that email address. So once you have the QBOA account set up, you can quickly and easily invite all other members of your firm to access this QBO account. Here's how you do it. Go to your gear in your QBOA and select Manage Users. That brings up this screen where you can invite other members of your firm. So you see, I already have five different users invited and I can invite more. You can invite four at a time and if you need to invite more than four, fill in for these, click on send, and then go back and enter more. The only option that you have is whether you invite somebody as a firm owner or as a user. And the difference is highlighted up here at the top. A firm owner gets access to the free my company file that comes as part of your QBOA subscription. Each person who gets invited will receive an email from the system and they will be prompted to create their own password. So everybody ends up having their own unique sign in to your firm's overall QBOA account. Then, for any of your clients who want to invite you to be their accountant or bookkeeper, they simply click on Invite Accountant and they enter in the generic email address for your firm. Anyone in your office who has been invited as a user on your QBOA account will then be able to see and work on any of your QBO clients. And the new version of QBOA that's coming in the first quarter of 2015 will even allow you to restrict which client files any of your firm users are allowed to see and work on. 
One quick reminder for the person who is managing that email address, the generic email address, when they accept the invitation from your client to access their QBO account, they have to remember to sign in using the login credentials for the, the, gen, for the generic email address, not for their personal login credentials. For example, if my personal login is brad at intuit.com and the generic email address that all your clients are inviting your firm to is info at intuit.com, I need to remember to log in as info when accepting the invitation. That will properly attach the client's account to the generic email and the generic QBOA account that you have created for your firm. I hope that helps to clarify how QBOA can allow you to efficiently and effectively manage all of your QBO clients, regardless of who in the office needs to work on the file. Thanks and enjoy your journey in QuickBooks Online.